Practicing parents, as we know, meals with the kids can get messy in more ways than one. But going back to the basics may be just what your family needs. Vanessa Welch has the details to help keep your kids on their best behavior at holiday dinners. These kids have a lot on their plate, but we're not talking about the chicken, salmon and tomatoes. You dab like this and this. You don't do like that and wipe like you're drying your face off. Tia Young teaches image and etiquette classes at Roy's restaurant. She helps them learn the right way to dine. And just put that on your lap like that. Young dishes out the do's and don'ts. Don't put condiments on your food until after the first bite. Don't bring electronics to the table and don't mix your food together. I think manners uh, is a lost art and I really want to bring it back. Putting the napkin on the lap has gone by the wayside. Young says eating out is just not easy for some. When the younger ones, it's hard for them to sit still and not fidget or run around and mix food, you know, on the table or put in their drink. She also says cutting can be tough. After Tia's tips, Zane Jack has caught on. You're supposed to put the fork in the left hand and the knife in the right hand. And you're supposed to do it the American way. You're supposed to cut the food, then put the knife with the rugged edges towards you, then switch the, the fork to the right hand and then eat it. The class gives the kids a taste of what fine dining feels like. She said, please, after she said what she wanted. Perfect. Young says minding manners at an early age will help these kids bring something to the table later in life. I'm Vanessa Welch reporting.